Hello, I'm Alex, an intern at ACM studying mechanical engineering at the University of Toledo. Recently, I have been working on a schedule for an installation of products with one of ACM's clients. Today, I want to share one of ACM's projects on alternative energy. They partnered with an investor-owned utility company to help create their first ever wind farm. They have continued investing in this renewable energy since the project and ACM is proud to have been there since the beginning. They are now the largest supplier of renewable energy in a Midwest state and provide natural gas and electricity to 68% of people in that area. In case you're wondering how a wind farm works, basically multiple turbines are built and connected together in a consistently windy area, such as near a body of water, to produce and store energy. These incredible machines are able to turn the kinetic energy from wind into electricity with their internal mechanisms. They will also automatically adjust to capture the most amount of wind at any time. One turbine can produce almost 12,000 megawatts of power a year. That's enough energy to power 3,120 toasters. Back from that little crash course, this was a $235 million project that lasted two years the park creates 100 megawatts of electricity every hour with only 56 turbines. This project would increase our customer's portfolio to 10% renewable energy in total. ACM's part to play was planning, scheduling, tracking project status, resource assignments, and cost analysis. They did this all with Oracle Primavera P6, SAP, which stands for Systems, Applications, and Products, and Lotus Notes Domino Wizard. During this process, the project team came across a few obstacles which led them to continue construction during wintertime. However, with many revisions and detailed planning, they were able to complete the project on time. ACM has gone through this process many times and continuously provides the best they have to offer. Specifically, but not limited to, at least four other wind energy projects. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget to click that little thumbs up and subscribe.